Hello, you're welcome to simplify this radical problem. So, in the first step, we start by simplifying this in the numerator. Then, after we get the simplified value in the numerator, we divide by the simplified value in the denominator. So, let's start by simplifying this in the numerator, which is square root of 10 plus square root of 15 plus square root of 20. Then, from square root of 10 is same as square root 10, it is 2 times 5. Then, plus square root of 15 to be square root 15, it is 3 times 5. Then, plus square root of 20, 20 is 4 times 5. Then in the next step, we separate this, it will be square root of 2, then times square root of 5, then plus, we separate this also, it will be square root of 3 times square root of 5, then plus, we separate this, it will be square root of 4, which is 2, then times square root of 5. Then in the next step, from here, square root of 5 is common. So, we'll take square root of 5 out of bracket. Then this, divided by this, it is this square root of 2. Plus, this, divided by this, it is this square root of 3. Plus, this, divided by this, it is this 2, then bracket. Now, from here, this is the simplified value in the numerator. Then in the next step, we simplify this denominator, which is square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus square root of 6 plus square root of 8 plus square root of 16. Then in the next step, it will be this, which is square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus square root of 6 is same as square root of 2, then times 3. Then plus square root of 8 is same as square root of 4, then times 2. Then plus square root of 16, it is 4. Then in the next step, it will be square root of 2 plus square root of 3 then plus we separate this it will be square root of 2 then times square root of 3 then plus we separate this square root of 4 it is 2 then times this square root of 2 then plus this 4 is same as 2 plus 2 then in the next step we take this plus this, plus this. So it will be square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus 2. Then plus this, which is square root of 2 times square root of 3, then plus this, which is 2 times square root of 2. Then, so we already take this, this, then plus, we are left with this 2. Then this 2, to have common square root of 2, 2 is same as square root of 2 times square root of 2. Then in the next step, we'll take this, which is square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus 2. Then you can place in the bracket plus. In here, square root of 2 is now in common. So we'll take square root of 2 out of bracket. Then this divided by this, it is this square root of 3, then plus this, divided by this, it is 2, then plus this, divided by this, it is square root of 2, then bracket. Now, in here, inside the bracket, they are the same. 2 square root of 3, square root of 2, square root plus square root of 3, plus 2, square root of 2, plus square root of 3, plus 2. So, we'll take square root of 2, plus square root of of 3 plus 2 bracket out of bracket then this divided by this it is 1 
plus this divided by this it is this square root of 2 bracket now this is the simplified value in the denominator then in the next step we take the simplified value in the numerator divide by simplified value in the denominator so this our simplified value in the numerator which is square root of 5 bracket square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus 2 bracket so from square root of 5 bracket square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus 2 bracket then over we divide by this simplified value in the denominator which is square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus 2 bracket bracket this 1 plus square root of 2 bracket then in the next step this square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus 2 is common so this will cancel with this so it will be equal to this which is square root of 5 over this 1 plus square root of 2 then in the next step from here we rationalize the denominator so we'll multiply in the denom in the denominator this denominator which is this the it will be 1 minus square root of 2 then we, we, we multiply this in the denominator and also in the numerator 1 minus square root of 2 which are the same which is same as 1 then in the next step it will be equal to square root of 5 times 1 is square root of 5 square root of 5 times negative square root of 2 is negative square root of 5 times 2 is 10 then over 1 times 1 is 1 1 times negative square root of 2 is negative square root of 2 square root of 2 times 1 it will be plus square root of 2 square root of 2 times negative square root of 2 it will be negative 2 then in the next step square root of 2 minus square root of 2 is 0 so this and this will cancel so it will be equal to this in the numerator which is square root of 5 minus square root of 10 over 1 minus 2 is negative 1 then negative 1 neg this negative 10 divided by negative 1 it is positive 10 square root of I mean square root of 10 negative square root of 10 divided by negative 1 it is positive square root of 10 square root of 5 divided by negative 1 it is negative square root of 5 so this is the simplified value in this our problem square root of 10 minus square root of 5 thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye